Hi, today I'd like to show you my Tesla coil I built. Yes, this one. And it's beautiful. Yeah, it took many months to build and it's finally done and it runs on two TIP31C transistors and it has a max voltage of five. Yes, I know, it's super low, but the output can produce super high voltage. For instance, I can light this fluorescent bulb way over here, which I don't know if you can tell, but is actually quite far away. And I'm in a very bright area here. Let's make this better. Yes, look at its glow. Right here, I'm like two and a half to three feet away from it. Well, it's hard to tell on a camera. You have to build it yourself for the amazing sensation it can produce. I have a fluorescent tube here, and I can turn it on with my Tesla coil, although it's kind of weak, so I'd like to make it a bit stronger. Well, I was hoping I'd see some arcs out of the top, but I got nothing when I ran this. I need a beefier transistor. Where do I get one of those? Something else that's kind of nifty with this coil is you can hold any device, or almost any device, up to the coil, and it kind of messes with it. Nothing noticeable right now, but now the touchscreen doesn't work at all. And to fix that, can you simply just turn your phone off, turn it back on, and it's back. Pretty weird, huh? Here is a circuit I've been using. I'd recommend having two TIP31C transistors because, well, they get pretty hot. And for voltage, I've been running it off four and a half to five volts, and it's been quite nice. You can go higher, but my transistors always melt. I don't know if I have a whole bunch of duds, or they're just not supposed to do it this way, or I'm doing it wrong. One of those three. And now, of course, for the demonstration. Here I have a fluorescent tube. No, it is not connected to anything, because that would be cheating. And if I bring it close to it, it actually starts glowing, which is pretty interesting. And as you get closer, it gets brighter. Sometimes when you get too close, though, it does dim. But I'm about right here. I'm about a foot and a half away from the Tesla coil. or And it's still glowing, so it works really well. And if I grab this little homemade other coil I have, it way over here the LED is glowing very bright so that's even that's way further away than the fluorescent tube here so that's impressive <laughs> maybe we'll even be able to see some arcs if I bring this point can you hear them? Do not be discouraged if your Tesla coil does not produce as much light and power as this one. Light? It doesn't produce any light. Something about this coil it makes me happy. I like it. Maybe it's just the fact that I can turn on fluorescent tubes this far away from it. Or I can make my own coil and light up an LED super far away. I really don't know, but whatever it is, it's really awesome. Maybe in the future, I'll make it even more powerful with better transistors. If you have any ideas of what kind of transistors I should use, post them in the comments below. Because, well, I only have these TIP31C transistors right now.